Chapter 2. Corporate Structure and Governance Introduction Chapter 2 explores the importance of corporate structure and governance in businesses. It discusses different types of business structures, such as sole proprietorships, partnerships, corporations, and hybrids. The chapter emphasizes the need for managers and employees to work on behalf of shareholders to increase stockholder value. Learning Objectives By the end of this chapter, you should be able to 1. Understand the advantages and disadvantages of different business structures. 2. Explain the concept of limited liability and its impact on business organizations. 3. Identify the benefits and drawbacks of corporations as the most common form of business organization. 4. Recognize the characteristics and benefits of limited liability corporations and partnerships. Key points. Sole proprietorships and partnerships have unlimited personal liability, making it difficult to raise large amounts of capital. Corporations are separate legal entities that limit stockholders' losses to the amount they originally invested in the firm. Corporations have unlimited lives and are easier to transfer shares of stock compared to unincorporated businesses. Corporations face the disadvantage of double taxation, where earnings are taxed at the corporate level and again as personal income for shareholders. As corporations, designed for small businesses, are taxed as proprietorships or partnerships and exempt from corporate income tax. Limited Liability Corporations, LLC, and Limited Liability Partnerships, LLP, provide liability protection but are taxed as partnerships. LLCs and LLPs offer flexibility in taxation and allow some partners to limit their liability. Companies operating in domestic and global markets face different governance and accounting regulations. International firms may adhere to international financial reporting standards, known as IFRS, instead of generally accepted accounting principles, known as GAAP. Real-world application. One real-world application of the concepts discussed in this chapter is the choice of organizational structure for a new business. As an aspiring entrepreneur, understanding the advantages and disadvantages of different business structures can help you make an informed decision. For example, if you plan to start a small business with a few partners, forming an LLC or LLP may provide liability protection while allowing flexibility in taxation. On the other hand, if you have ambitious growth plans and need to raise significant capital, incorporating as a corporation may be more suitable. Conclusion Corporate structure and governance play a crucial role in the success of businesses. Different business structures offer various advantages and disadvantages, such as liability protection, tax implications, and ease of raising capital. Corporations, with their separate legal entity status and limited liability for stockholders, are the most common form of business organization. However, smaller businesses may benefit from the tax advantages and flexibility offered by S corporations, LLCs, and LLPs. Understanding these concepts can help entrepreneurs make informed decisions when choosing the most appropriate organizational structure for their businesses. By considering the learning objectives, key points, and real-world applications discussed in this chapter, you can develop a solid foundation in corporate structure and governance, enabling you to navigate the complexities of business ownership and management successfully.